number 14, part seven on develop your third eye and intuition. And today we're going to be doing a meditation. Okay, so we're gonna start off doing our practice and we're gonna do uh, a form of meditation to get ourselves centered. Something that I realized by doing all the videos, so this is part, part seven, right? And something that I realized through doing the videos is that I'll talk about like, oh, be centered, now get centered and go into, you know, asking the question. And for some people, that's hard, right? I don't even, like some people might, might not even know what getting centered really looks like. So what I am going to be sharing with you today is a simple meditation to getting yourself centered so that when I tell you get centered, you know exactly the feeling that you need to get yourself into. Doesn't necessarily mean you have to do it this specific way, but I want you to get used to the feeling. And something that I want you to really start catching from watching all of my videos up to this lesson number 14 is that as you go along, you're going to learn different things. And that one of the key things that I'm going to be telling you that you're going to hear consistently is connecting with the feeling. Okay, so I am really excited to be here now. I'm using a different software, so I'm so excited to to really just be here with you. So I'm going to turn on also my phone like I do every week. And I want to thank all the replay viewers and the people who are live. Remember that you can share this video. When you share this video, you get entered into a drawing each month that I do to win a reading. I mean, to win a one hour free coaching session with me, a one hour coaching session that is a value of 197, yours completely free if you win the session. So the way that you can do that is by sharing my live videos. And I just announced two winners for the month, for this past month, right before going live on this video. So you could check that out to see if you were the winner. Okay, great. So now I just want to make sure that I am, oops, here we go. So I just want to make sure that it is working and I have my phone just in case the comments or whatever the case may be. So as we do every week, I want to recite the pledge with you. So I have my pledge here. And the way that you can get your pledge statement is by going to my website, miracleswithinus.net backslash pledge, okay? If you're on my Facebook page, if you just click on the Facebook page, um, sign up button, it will take you directly so that you can get this and all the videos from past lessons. So I'm really excited to do this with you. So let's recite our pledge. And I ask that you recite this alongside with me. I pledge that from this moment on, I will do whatever it takes to be the best version of myself. I will be kind to myself. I will love in every state that I am in. I will invest in my personal growth. I say yes to myself. And I completely embody the belief that I am more than good enough to attract all good into my life. Okay, so that is our pledge. And the words in this pledge, right, there's specific way of the wording in the pledge. And that is because that the angels put it in the form so that it could trigger responses within you every single time that you recite the pledge. So one of the things that really stand out for me is loving myself in every state that I am in. That is something that is very profound and it really eliminates me making myself wrong and it also eliminates me seeing other people as wrong. It really just allows me to be compassionate and understanding and to hold a space of love and for everyone. 
So see what part of the pledge really sits with you. What really stood out? You know, maybe it's, you know, I'm more than good enough to attract all good into my life. Maybe that creates a feeling within you. Okay, so whatever part that's your favorite, embody that. Embody the feeling of what that looks like. Okay, so awesome. So today we're going to be doing part seven on develop your third eye and intuition. And we're going to be talking about getting ourselves centered. One of the easiest ways that I have found is through meditation right? When you learn how to meditate or get yourself in a meditative state, you could really be centered and it allows you to get even more clear response from your higher self, from your spirits. Okay. So I want you to see that. Okay. So now this is what I'm going to ask you to just get a little bit relaxed. Make sure you have no distractions. Okay. No one's saying, Hey, take me, mommy, watch me, this and that. No, it's completely just you. Okay. So now I want you to do whatever you need to do to get yourself that you're not distracted. So you could be fully present for this guided meditation that I'm going to take you on to, so that you can recognize the feeling of being centered, okay? So that when we go on from this moment on and I say to you, now bring yourself to feeling centered, you know the feeling of that and you could bring yourself there very quickly, okay? And this is going to help you throughout life, not just when I tell you to do it, but when you want to feel centered. Okay. And know that the power is within you, not outside of you, but within you. And this is something that I'm very, very passionate about and want to show you how you can step into being that and doing that. Okay, great. So at times I will close my eyes and I will open them so that I'm engaging. But the easiest way is to start closing your eyes and now start listening to the sounds and I just want you to hold on to the sounds of my voice. If your mind is chattering, say thank you for sharing. I'll talk to you later. Melissa's talking now. And I'm going to learn how the feeling is of feeling centered. Okay, wonderful. So now I want you to close your eyes and follow the sound voice. I want you now to visualize a beam of light above your head coming from the sky. This pure white light from the sky pouring down, down, down towards the crown of your head. Now allow this light to come into your head and come into you, come coming, coming in and it's going down, down, down through your head through your eyes, going into your ear space, illuminating you. Okay, now this light continues to go down into your nose, into your mouth area. And just let that energy just continue to come down, down, down. This is pure white light. It is completely safe. It is the source of where you come from. Now allow this light to go down into your throat area, clearing out any junk that may be holding there, any limited beliefs that say you are not good enough or you're, you don't have important words to share. We're now removing that and bringing down the light. Come down, down, down to our shoulders, going down our arms, through our fingertips. Now allow this light to come down, down, down into your chest, into the breast area, going down, down, down into your heart. And just let this light get stronger and stronger in your heart center. Let it radiate through you. Now allow this light to continue to come and pour down its beautiful white light, going down, down, down into your stomach, illuminating every organ in your body. Allow this light to seep in there. And at any point, 
If you feel that you need to take in a deep breath in and out, do so as you are adjusting to the light that is coming in your true source of who you are. Now allow this light to go down, down, down into your hips. Okay, illuminating your hips, going down, down, down into your to the knees, going down your calves, into the ankles, going to the soles of your feet. Now allow this light to go completely through you, coming out of the soles of your feet, going down, down, down into the earth, to our Mother Earth. And Mother Earth receives this beautiful white light and she gives us now with her beautiful light. And that light comes through the earth, coming up, up, up through the earth, through the soles of your feet. Now allow this light in. This is safe, nurturing love. And allow this light to you up through your legs, going up, up, up your calves, through your knees, to your hip area, illuminating you. Now allowing this light to continue to come up, up, up through the hips, going up through the solar plex, through your stomach, illuminating every organ in your body. And allow this light to continue to go up, up, up into your heart space and let it meet with the light from above and the light from below. You are now connected from the light from above and the light from below. And now I want you to connect your own inner light, your own inner light. And now we have three beaming lights happening in your heart center. And just feel that feeling. Feel the feeling. Feel the trust. Feel the love. Feel the loyalty. Feel the showing up in your life. Feel this right now. This is the feeling of being centered. In that feeling for as long as you can. And just let that light continue to grow. Let that light continue to intertwine within one another. Light from above, the light from within you, your pure, your true light, and the light from Mother Earth. And now you feel completely safe. Now allow this light to illuminate outside of your body, just like a beautiful expansion of yourself. Feel your energy expand through your heart center, all through your body now. There is like a globe of light from the center of your heart, glowing outside of your full body, glowing you, protecting you, keeping you safe. Take in the deep breath in and let it go. <sighs> great, wonderful, you're doing such a great job and I can feel all this beautiful positive energy coming from you. So now, this is the feeling of feeling centered. Now slowly start waking up your body. You may want to move your hands and your shoulders and open your eyes. Welcome, my beautiful soul. Welcome and hello to you being this illuminated, beautiful being of light. That is the truth of who you are, this beautiful globe of light. And I want you to remember this as you for the rest of your days, okay? You are this beautiful light. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Don't even let yourself talk yourself out of this experience. So from this moment on, when I sit and tells you it's time for you to get centered, you know exactly the feeling of what that feels like. You don't have to go through this process if you don't want to. And that is completely up to you. The process is great. So I love going through the process of bringing the light from above and bringing the light from below and connecting my own inner light with this light and creating this merging of energies. 
okay and really feeling centered that is the feeling of feeling centered and that is what i wanted to focus on for today's session not so much of doing any type of practice that you've seen me do every single week where I give you to do the yes, here's your questions. And I realized that I was not teaching you how to be centered. So now I am here. Now you know exactly what it feels like. And this is something that you can take for the. So now you with that. I want to thank you so very much for being here with me. Enjoy this beautiful place that you are in right now. Enjoy it. I am so happy to be able to deliver this to you and to do what I love. And I thank you from my heart to your heart that you allow me to do this and to be present in front of you and to do what I love. So for this week, you know, this is going, if you listen to my weekly angelic week, there's going to be a lot of energies around miscommunications. So this practice of getting yourself centered will help you feel more able to connect with people and deliver your message and also to receive the messages that people are saying and also to receive the of you. Right When you're asking, what is in my highest interest to do today? What is in my highest interest to do with this project? What is in my highest interest for this? Right, And remove the word should and move into what is in my highest interest. It gives you so much power. Should is diminished. I want you to notice that. I want you to, what is good? So if you want to receive all the videos up to here, we are now part seven, lesson number 14. If you want to get all the videos, you can do that by going to my website, miracleswithinus.net backslash pledge. I will have the link below this video. And if you're on my Facebook page, if you hit the sign up button, it will take you to join the pledge so you can get this information into your inbox. And it's completely free. It's there for you so that you can utilize it. Because the more people that are enlightened, the more people that are working from a place of love, the easier and the more effective the way the world starts operating. And this is my contribution to the universe of sharing what has been beautifully given to me to share with you, you you to help me share that message so when you share this video you're not only entering to win a one which is great but you're also giving the gift of sharing this beautiful light and this beautiful place of feeling centered okay and just think about all life that you would like to see feel this sense of feeling. I have many people who I'm like, you just need to learn how to feel centered and everything will start working its way through you. And all of the things that don't work will start diminishing and leaving. So I hope you enjoy this. I enjoy being here with you. Happy holidays. Enjoy yourself. Be easy and share your kindness with you with those around you and until the next time i love you unconditionally namaste <laughs>